Hey YouTube, it's your girl Tay here back with another video. This video is going to be for the sign of uh, Pisces. And so if you do have Pisces as your sun, moon, and a rising sign, there will be messages in here for you. Uh, please take the part that resonates and leave the rest. Also, please keep in mind that this is not a one-to-one -one reading, but a general reading. All right. Pisces, what's up? What y'all doing? How y'all doing? What the fuck is good? What's popping? What to do? All right. Um, your overall energy for this reading is love. All right. That's your overall energy. Um, let's go ahead and see. We'll we'll get back to that. We'll see what's going on with the tarot. Okay. All right, dear spirit guides, angels, and ancestors, I pray for accurate insight into Pisces carrying energies and carrying circumstances. If there are any hidden enemies, I pray that they reveal. Thank you so much for your presence. All right, Pisces. So what I'm getting here um, with your reading is that you have. Okay, so first off, you have the Five of Pentacles. Um, you have the Five of Pentacles, the Three of Swords, and the Four of Cups. Okay. So with the Five of Pentacles, I feel like I feel like you're walking away from something, something that is not for fulfilling, okay? Um, and I feel like, yeah, I feel like whatever the fuck you're doing, whatever whatever job you're at, whatever position you're in, I feel like it, it doesn't fit you. It's not what you want to do, okay? It, it's it's just not enough. Is what I'm getting. It's just not. And so what you're you're taking the the shit that you got and you're moving on to something that's that's um that could be better for you um but i feel like um with the three of swords here i feel like you have mental you have negative negativity that you're holding on to that needs to be re that that needs to be released so maybe you had some type of heartbreak in the past or um i feel like you, I feel like you're not, you're just not, you're not satisfied with what you have at this time. Yeah, I feel like you're not satisfied. It doesn't, it's not, it's not enough. And I feel like you're just, um, but with the four of cups here, I feel like you, you have everything you need, can, um, Pisces. I was about to call you cancer, so you could be dealing with a cancer, but you have everything you need at this time. I feel like there's needs to be grateful. Yeah, I feel like there is a need to be grateful for what you have and um gratitude does um allow the universe to provide you with more of that okay yes you have the lovers here queen of pentacles and high priestess so with the lovers i feel like um yeah i feel like you could have passion with someone maybe you guys are on a, on a good page at this time okay with the lovers and the queen of pentacles yeah so i feel like Maybe you're you're you benefit from your partner's uh finances at this time. But I feel like you have nothing that you need, but you have everything that you um yeah, you have nothing that you need at this time. Yeah, everything that you need, you have it. Um, but I feel like you may want more, okay, which is where that energy come in, that five of pentacles come in. Like you what you're doing is not enough, okay. High priestess here, so I do feel like um, you could be just um, diving deeper into your spiritual practice, or um, going to church more, or whatever the fuck. You could be just doing something that that costs that is um, that speaks to your soul. Is what I'm getting. Something that is so satisfying. Okay. All right, with the hanged man, I feel like there's a need for you to look at something from a different perspective. Um, there is, there, there, there is. With the hanged man here, you need to look at something from a different perspective. Maybe wherever you're at, you're not happy with it. So it's like, it's like, okay, for example, you make minimum wage. Hopefully, I mean, I don't know. Maybe you make minimum wage and you're not happy with that. And so instead of you trying to... Um, see how you can become a team lead or be become a supervisor to increase your finances it just feels like you're just saying fuck it like i'm not even going to work because i make minimum wage or um that's that's probably what you're saying but i just feel like you have everything you need but you're not happy with where you are so i feel I, I'm, all, I'm i'm kind of get, getting that you're giving up on something there's no emotion here. There's nothing here. Yeah. 
But spirit is asking you to, um, you need to think at this about the situation from a different perspective. Because when you, okay. When you think like, okay, I don't have this, I don't have that, I don't have what I want, so I'm not doing shit, that causes, you know what the fuck you do. You do. So, I, the, the, it, you just, there's need for you to be grateful. Two of Swords, yeah, there's need for you to choose, be grateful. I do feel like you have a passion new start. I feel like you have a passion new start that you're trying to go, go towards. Um... Yeah, I feel like you will make it make a decision here. Yeah, and and you could be already looking at things from a different perspective. I feel like there's need to use your emotions and how you feel about certain things. All right. Let's see. What is Pisces not what is Pisces not um, happy with? What is Pisces not happy with? All right, Ace of Cups in Reverse and Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, so you're not ha you're not happy with whatever. Um, this new job or whatever the fuck this is maybe you started a new a new job and, and you can come to find out the company is bullshit so you're trying to like you're not happy here so you're, you're thinking about leaving period is what i'm getting i feel like um there's a need for you to just um yeah i feel like there's a need for you to stay put until you find Hopefully you stay and put it till you find another position. You know what I'm saying? Don't just be leaving this shit, but leaving your job because, or I don't fucking know. Okay, I'm just talking. Actually, I'm not talking. I'm telling you what the fuck I feel <laughs> and how I see shit. Yeah, make sure you have another opportunity before you just leave, period. What's this high priestess? You have eight of ones and the empress. All right, clarifying the high priestess. So I feel like you're very in tune right now. You could be pregnant, okay, or you could be about to give birth, or this is this you're giving birth to an idea, okay. Whatever the fuck this is, you feel I feel I do feel like you're manifesting something into this material realm. I feel like you are in your head with the high priestess. You are um very in tune. You're very enlightened about what the fuck is going on. I feel like can't nobody put no wolves wool over your eyes as you see shit for what the fuck it is. Your third eye is opened. Yes, it is. Eight of Wands here, so something's coming in really fast. You may have, uh, you may think that you're that something is going on um, in regards to some something in regards to a fertility, um, and I feel like you, you're getting news either from the doctor or you're getting some type of news that's coming in really fast. Okay, this can even be in regards to a new position. Maybe you're you're thinking about going somewhere else, which it looks like you are, um, and you maybe you're trying to brush up on some skills to manifest this. Um, so that way you can get the, the, the type of position that you want to have, okay? The type of position that, that's going to um, provide for you and your family without you having to break a fucking leg, arm, and hip, okay? Yes. All right, what's this? Nine of Cups and the King of Swords. So the two of ones, for the two of ones, this is something, some, something that you're, you're working on, something that you are, um, you have passion about, and that you want to just go out and try. Okay, go out and expand what you currently have. You want to expand. Okay, expand your money. Okay, that's what I'm getting here. With the nine of cups, I do feel like. You have the Nine of Cups and the King of Swords clarifying this. So I feel like whatever whatever you're doing, you will be happy with it. Um, it will bring a great abundance, great fulfillment to you. I see you smiling. I see you happy with a big ass smile on your face. Okay, just living life, doing what the fuck you want to do. Like not worried about um, where you're going to get your next meal from or where, you, like, I don't know. It's just, you're happy, okay? The mental clutter, mental, mental anguish has... Uh, has cleared as well.
Yeah, so you could be dealing with an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. Yeah, I feel like I just I just feel like you, you want more. You want more more out of life, more out of love, okay? I feel like you you're done with the heartbreak, you're done with the sadness, anguish, you're done with all that shit. Like I feel like you're ready for the next level. Yes, and which is why you 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 have the high priestess here. So, you you're starting to see things from a different aspect, from a different perspective. You you're also starting to develop your spirituality and your third eye so you could be doing some uh third eye chakra healing okay yeah something that you could be working with crystals as well something to open up your third eye so that way you can you can realize and and um be in tune with what the fuck is going on yeah all right, next up you have love. That's your overall energy for this reading. It says, I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things, okay? It says, you are love, okay? You are. Um, your soul is made of God's pure divine vibrational force of love and that you need to bring this awareness to bear on every aspect of your life and being. Love is a healing energy. All anxiety and drama cannot exist in the aura of love. Yeah, so there's a need to just be, um, be show love, receive love, just be in the flow of love, okay? Whatever you do, do it with love. Love covers a multitude of sins. Next up, you have balance. It says heart or mind, body or soul, creative or calculated, masculine or feminine, soft or strong, spirit or science, momentum or rest, sun or moon, summer or winter. What is life but a beautiful, delicious mixture of both? Perhaps if it doesn't have to be one or the other, perhaps if we were made to be some things. I'm sorry. Perhaps we were made to be some things, but then also everything, all in one. After all, the sun and the moon exist together in the sky. It is simply our perspective that keeps us from seeing both the same, both at the same time. Yeah, like I said, with this hangman, there's need to change your perspective on how you see shit. Can um, Pisces? I don't know what the fuck you're calling Cancer. Pisces. There's a need to change your perspective of how you see shit, okay? There is. There is. Next up, you have Mother Nature. Mother Nature. It says, the earth is my provider, and I receive life from her. I use her water and food to nourish my body and brain. Nature leads me toward acceptance and peace. Nature leads me toward acceptance and peace. Yeah, so be in tune, you know what I'm saying? Love, peace, and love and happiness. Some will make it do wrong, make it do right. I don't know, is it Al Green? I don't know who sang that song, but that's what came to mind. Love and happiness, love and happiness. That's your overall energy for this reading. Yeah. Um, yeah, be peaceful, be love, okay? Give love, you know what I'm saying? Yes, all right? All right, uh, Pisces, but that's really all I have for you guys today. I want to thank you so much for tuning in. I want to thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing, and fucking with me. Talk to me, I'll talk back, and until next time, bye, Pisces.